Hello everyone, this is the day that the Lord has made and we will rejoice and be glad in it. The Bible tells us in Psalms 146 verses 6 to 9, let the high praise of God be in their mouth and a two-edged sword in their hands to execute vengeance upon the heathen and punishments upon the people, to bind their kings with, with chains and their nobles with fetters of iron, to execute upon them the judgment written, this honor have all his saints. Praise ye the Lord. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that God will give you the keys to unlock all the doors to your blessing in Jesus name. I also pray for you that wonderful changes will begin to be your lot from today in the mighty name of Jesus. Friends, there are times we need to encourage ourselves in the Lord like David, a man after God's heart. During our devotionals, we want to really flow with praises to God. <clears throat> But, but at times, we may run out of appropriate songs. If this has never happened to you, that is great. But it happens to me sometimes. And this is why I have the burden to compile some songs that people can incorporate in their daily devotional. In Psalms 149 that says, Let the high praises of God be in their mouth and a two-edged sword in their hands. The songs that I have compiled are all from the Bible, which means they are the word of God, which is the sword of the spirit. The Bible tells us the word of God is quick, powerful, and sharper than any two-edged sword. Someone once said, when power meets with power, the lesser power must bow. Can you imagine the awesome power you can generate from praising God with his own words? Friends, God is a spirit and they that worship him must do so in spirit. God's word as spirit and life. These songs from the book of Psalms are so many that I may need to do a part two and a part three of this video. I'm, I'm pretty certain of that because they, they're not going to all fit in this video. As, as you incorporate them into your daily devotion, and sing God's words back to him, I pray that as it is written in Psalm 67 verse 6, then shall the earth yield her increase, and God, even our own God, shall bless us. Let us praise. Oh, that man would praise the Lord. Oh, that man would praise the Lord. For his goodness and for his wonderful works to the children of men and especially for me. He has broken the gates of brass and caught the bars of fire in sunder. There is none holy as the Lord. There is none besides him. Neither is there any rock like our God. There is none holy as the Lord. I will sing unto the Lord. For he has triumphed gloriously, the horse and its rider has he thrown into the sea. Who is like unto thee? O Lord, who is like unto thee? O Lord, among the gods. Who is like thee, glorious in holiness and fearful in praises, always doing wonders, hallelujah. From the rising of the sun 
to the going down of the same. The name of the Lord is to be praised from the rising of the sun to the going down of the same. The name of the Lord is to be praised. Everybody ought to praise them in the sanctuary. Praise them in the farmer. Praise them. Hallelujah for the Lord. God, omnipotent reign. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah for the Lord. God, omnipotent reign. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Blessings and 